Hello guys, Astro Blitzy Gaming here, back with another video. Today is going to be a Minecraft tutorial and I'm going to be building Monica's apartment. I've laid it out into steps, so step one is going to be the foundations of the main, like, living room and kitchen, not the room, not the bathrooms and the bedrooms yet. So, the blocks you'll need for the foundations are light blue terracotta, lime terracotta, smooth stands, sandstone and brick block. Uh, so you want to go on floor with your light blue terracotta and do one, two, three, four, five, six, three here, then across by five, one, two, three, four, five, then up by two, across by six, one, three, four, five, six, down by two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, up by two across by three this should look like that and you want to go up by six one two three four five six then across uh and then you want to do eight one two three four five six seven eight and then six in one two three four five six then you want to do uh across here you want to do two there then you want to go across with your smooth sandstone uh, five one two three four five and then two at the end so that should be nine in total then you want to go up five one two three four five then with your lime terracotta you want to go across by four one two three four then you want to go down by 11, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Now of your brick blocks, you want to go uh, across by 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, diagonal 1, and then now 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and join it together using light blue terracotta and that should be your base uh, that's step one complete um so yeah in now on step two so guys on step two which is now digging out all of this grass inside of the area and replacing it with oak wood planks so yes yeah, so just digging out all the grass And replacing it with oak planks so yeah I'll see you when I've done it right guys so now that you've dug it all up replaced it with oak planks it should look like this uh, so now you guys have completed step two uh, so yeah on to step three right so step three we want to get the walls and the doors done so the blocks you'll need is light blue terracotta smooth sandstone black stained glass black stained glass pane block of quartz lime terracotta iron door crimson door and purple terracotta so first thing you want to do is just along here leave a along here you want to break blocks there three blocks so there's a gap there gap there but you want to build up along here you want to build up four blocks so one two three four using purple terracotta one two three four just uh, block that off there so two blocks down and then on the floor just I'll just place any block for now doesn't really matter um, so then you've got that door done and then al along here you want to just build up so along for a couple of you just want to build up with light blue terracotta all along here all the way up here along here along here along here along here, along here. but then here you want to leave a two block gap from there what break three blocks up here and you want to build the same door and 
as we did last time. And then actually, on top of all of this, you want to add another row of light blue terracotta, like this. If you're wondering why I'm using light blue terracotta, is because in the show, uh, the purple on the walls are quite light, and well, this is the closest thing I can get. I quite like it. If you guys want to use just normal purple, uh, you feel free. Go ahead. Um, yeah, up here. Then we want to do the same thing here. So, two block gap from that side. Up here. Up here. Uh, from here, then you want to do purple terracotta along here. Crimson door, purple terracotta. If you're wondering why I'm using a crimson door, it's the closest thing I could get to purple. Also, the door is the same colour as the walls, but they just blend in too much, so uh, I'm using this little terracotta up here. But actually, from here, uh, sorry about this, I just realised this, um, you want to, from this place here, place a line of smooth sandstone on the top instead of purple terracotta sorry about that guys just remembered so along here there and then in this this is like the big window so you want to go place black stained glass behind here going up three blocks high in total like this so that window should look like that and then purple terracotta all the way along here again some sandstone on top um, then over here is like the cupboard place so just break this and place an iron door and then you want to do lime terracotta is mm, whoops uh, not black stained glass uh, smooth sandstone on top um, then here from this area here come break these three blocks and replace them with light blue terracotta build up four more blocks like so and then along here you want to do one two three this is for the whoops, uh, this is for the bathroom door because the bathroom is located here and crimson door and then um, here build another block up and then the rest is just smooth sandstone and that goes along there as well and I th yeah that smooth sandstone goes along here and then uh, come back to over here just fill that up like so um, and then you just got the kitchen area so place a block of quartz going around but leave out that corner block because just build two blocks up with black stained glass and then the rest of it should all be a block I missed out brick block sorry about that guys missed forgot and that build up the brick block like this and that should be all the walls done uh, so yeah that's step three done and then um, step four will be decorating all the walls so yes uh, let's move on to step four uh, guys quickly before we start step four I just noticed that these the three blocks above the door shouldn't be uh, smooth sandstone it should be black stained glass and then this should just be light blue terracotta yeah sorry about that so guys step four is we're going to be doing the kitchen so you need quite a lot of materials item frame furnace black carpet light blue carpet birch button flower pot scaffolding birch wood planks yellow banner gray banner blue orchid oxide daisy orange concrete block of quartz purple concrete spruce trap door corn flower yellow concrete red concrete allium blue concrete light blue concrete and well that's another yellow banner so you don't need that so yeah there's materials you need so we're going to be doing the kitchen here but the first thing 
on top of this here just place a yellow banner in there you don't have to if you don't want to but it's like trying to represent that thing they have on their door um yeah uh, so the first thing you want to do is grab your light blue concrete and here you want to come out two blocks like that on the end and then you want to come across to the end here and we're going to start by decorating that spot yeah here so two flower pot pots and then two coming out uh, spots then you want to grab your uh, light blue carpet and so you want to break these two blocks here press furnace in there and black black carpet on top on top of that black carpet you want to place light blue carpet uh, there and there you want to also grab your spruce trap doors and place them here and on top of there place some more light blue carpet apart from that end one so like that uh, but not the end one uh, now you've got that you want to uh, get your item frames uh, sorry if I'm a bit bad at explaining this this is my first tutorial but I will be doing more on the channel uh, place item frames on the end three blocks fill them in with flower pots and on top of them place light blue carpet like that uh, then you want to grab your grey banner and place two there uh, and then along here you want to place item frames going up like that with block of quartz in so it'll look like that and then you want to grab yourself birch buttons and place them along here apart from that one you'll see why later and then you also want to grab yourself some yellow banner place it there and there and there and there no nope, not like that sorry uh there 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 so like that and i think now that's part that's that part done oh nope uh you just want to grab yourself some corn flour and some oxide daisy just pop that in there like that so should look like that looks quite nice then you want to grab yourself some light blue concrete again go two along here place yellow banners on them and that's why we can place a birch button here because well it wouldn't well the banner wouldn't go in these are meant to be towels and then you want to grab scaffolding and one two like that on there place two flower pots then you want to grab your birch trap doors on there they're like blue concrete then you want to grab some block of quartz uh, two by three and your birch wood planks up here with birch buttons on them uh, and yeah that should be it although you can optionally uh, get out your item frames and this is just optional if you don't want to do it completely fine I'm sure a lot, a lot of people might not like it uh, let's just grab all your concrete uh, just place item frames all over the fridge and uh, fill it in with the different colour concretes to represent uh, refriger the refrigerator magnets. Um, yeah. And now you want blue orchid and allium. Put them in the flower pots here. And yeah, that should be the kitchen done. So on step five, which is doing the kitchen table. Okay, right, step four 
uh, is doing the kitchen table. So uh, the materials you need is spruce fence, oak trapdoor, crimson trapdoor, birch trapdoor, scaffolding, acacia trapdoor, and acacia wood planks. So what you want to do is you want to count from this end, like blue concrete next to the furnace, you want to count in three blocks, one, two, three, and the scaffolding, acacia planks behind, and birch trapdoor, so it looks something like a, something like a chair. In front of it, you want to place uh, some. You want to place a spruce fence, and then to the right of that, place another, and just make it a two by two square. And then here, you want to place another scaffolding, and uh, acacia behind it, and birch trap door on top to make the chair. Uh, now you want to do the same thing on each side. Uh, so that, so it kind of like, they, they like, they're like a block away from each other, if you know what I mean. Uh, so they're not like, that's there and that's there. Um, then one here, of course. Comes in trap door. And yeah, then on the table you want to place some, whoops, oak trap doors. For the table, and that should be your table done. Now just a quick thing to do, where the fridge is here, you want to build up acacia planks to the top, all the way across, and all the way down, and then on the side here you want to place uh, acacia trapdoors going up the side for the shelves, and yeah, step 5 will be doing this area here and this area here. So guys, step five uh, materials is uh, wait this part here and this part here. Obviously, they don't actually show you it in the show, so I kind of just made it up. So the materials you'll need is birchwood stairs, block of quartz, flower pot, blue orchid, end rod, white glazed terracotta, item frame, spruce wood slab, spruce wood stairs, paper, and book book and quill. So the first thing you want to do is on the ends place birchwood stairs two like that and then one there and it should automatically curve that in the middle place block of quartz coming in with an end rod on the back one and white glazed terracotta on top in front of it flower pot and blue orchid then uh, over on this part you want to do one block in on both sides spruce wood stairs facing inward two slabs there and you want to do a stair one block from the end on that side uh, on the very end of the left you want to do end rod white glazed terracotta two item frames in front of the chair and then on the very end uh, and then a flower pot with nothing in and you want to do paper uh, book and quill you want to do paper here just spin it around so it's good if it's not right for you and there, so that should be step five done. Step six is actually doing the main sitting area. So yeah, let's get on with it. Right, so step seven is the main sitting area. The blocks you'll need is block of quartz, quartz slab, birchwood slab, glass, scaffolding, end rod, white glazed terracotta, flower pot, azure, Bluet, I think that's how you pronounce it. Orange wool, black wool, brown wool, smooth sandstone, birch wood planks, spruce wood planks, oak trap door, spruce trap door, oak fence, and dark prismarine slab. So first thing you want to do is grab uh, the orange, no, the black, brown, and smooth sandstone, um, and from this uh, acacia trap door here, count in four blocks so including this one one two three four break a black wall there break all the way along until you're one like directly in front of the end of that door and like one away from being in front of the acacia like line and break that all the way until you're one block off the door 
and yeah just connect it like so quite easy then in the corners here you want to place brown wool like this and then brown wool coming off of either side of it so here and here here and here and yeah and then you just want to fill the rest of it in with smooth sandstone I would use like another wool like a white wool but uh, the carpet isn't that white so I decided to go with new sandstone because it just has a nicer texture to it than the white wall. Right, so fill, filling that in now. So guys, this is the second to last step. The last step is just doing the TV and the paintings and the balcony, not the, not the balcony itself, uh, like the desk area because this is two parts as you can tell in the title part one and then part two is doing the bathroom and the bedrooms and the balcony okay right so now you've done that you want to grab your block of quartz and your quartz slab you want to on the back here get your from the top right hand corner leave a gap of one place a block of quartz break along until you've got a gap of one there as well place line a quartz slab on top quartz slab in front quartz slab on either side so it looks somewhat like a sofa and you want to place a glass block next on the left of the sofa with a flower pot and a zerblet don't know how to pronounce it on the other side scaffolding end rod white glazed terracotta and then here you want to grab your oak fence spruce trap door and oak trap door and you want to get your oak fence leave a gap of one in front have three so in the middle and then go back two so it should be a three by three area and in the middle going across you want spruce trap door and on either side you want oak trap door and just get a uh, an orange wall in front of it so now you want to get your birch slab uh, birch birch wood uh, and uh, spruce wood and here you want to do two birch wood there no, two birch wood there so it's not touching scaffolding and you want to do birch wood behind there and slab there so the, the first two are slabs you want to do sp a spruce next to it and then you want to grab your quartz again and your prismarine slab dark prismarine slab and from here so count from the corner here one two so one two three then place a block a slab and a block and a slab in front then you want to place a prismarine just there and yeah that should be the seating area done now on to the last step right step eight is, this is the final step of part one so um, the materials you need is painting acacia wood slab lantern spruce wood slab spruce wood stairs item frame paper booking quill birch trap door brown carpet black carpet black wool flower pot, dandelion, arcacia wood planks, terracotta, oak leaves, scaffolding and yellow banner. So uh, what you want to do first is you want to come to this area here by the bedroom door here and you want to do well you want to get like you want to do so it kind of looks a bit like that so you have next to the door painting spot there and you should put it in and it should be a one by one painting and yes break them and that should look like that and then now grab your acacia wood uh, planks leave a two block gap in the tv area one two three four then you want to get black wool the TV with black carpet on top 
then you want to grab terracotta and oak leaves and you want to terracotta in the corner and oak leaves on top then a flower pot here and a dandelion it's a flower pot and dandelion and with your painting uh, that put it up there so just so the spot you need to put in so above the paint above the TV so above the dandelion right here and yeah that should be that area done and coming over to this area on the other side you want to get scaffolding a uh, brown carpet lanterns acacia and paintings so place two scaffolding brown carpet make that like that and then place two acacia planks up there so there's half block gap of light blue terracotta left and lanterns below right now onto the balcony area you want to grab some your yellow banner and place it going going up the side here and across the top like so and then you want to grab your birch trap door and place that going along the top here then your spruce wood slab spruce wood stairs place that going like that that going like that and spruce wood slab in the middle and then have spruce wood stair that way uh, facing inwards for a chair and you want to place item frames on each one get your booking quill and paper booking quill on either end paper paper in the middle turn them so they're that way around and yeah now we come over to this spot by the shelves um, grab spruce wood slab lantern uh, yeah that's and so now you want to do something that should look like that and place try and then get a painting as well try and preferably whoops uh hold on just trying to fix that right uh, try and preferably get the black one that kind of color because it matches kind of and then spruce wood slab above there lanterns dangling from below and the last part which is over here you just really want to place some random paintings around if you're, uh, you, you obviously won't have this in your inventory unless you get it but um, just get any block or slab to do this and well just randomly add in paintings like that that kind of suit the wall so it's quite random like that that'll do uh, so yeah guys thank you so much for watching uh, uh, this if you're wondering why I hadn't uploaded for a while it's because um, well this did take a long time to make so please show your support by leaving a like and subscribing and uh, I will I'll have part two out as soon as possible